So this is the rule for this. Let me just. So this is the product property of logarithms. Uh, again, the proof of this is on YouTube. So if you guys want to watch that video and fall asleep, then you're welcome to. But uh, I'll link it to uh, Canvas as well. So what this is saying, and I guess I kind of have this backwards, right? You see how we have the log base and the same log base? But we're adding the two together, right? So since we have these two same log with the same base, we can combine them to be log. It's still base 3, but we're going to take the 5 and multiply it by the x to equal 1. See, now we can change this into uh, an exponential equation which would be much easier to solve because now we have just one logarithm. So, <clears throat> now one, one thing people do on this is that make it log base 3 of 5 plus x, but remember the, the addition here makes it multiplication when we make it one log. So just don't get that confused, all right? So if I change this into exponential form, I've got 3 to the power of 1 equals the 5x. So in order to solve for x, I would just divide both sides by 5. And we can see then that x is 3 fifths. Now you could put this in your calculator just to check. You'd have log of 5 over log of 3 plus log of 3 fifths over log of 3. And you should get 1. 